What's going on guys? Game Guy here bringing you a new playthrough. This is Pokemon Emerald. And this is not going to be no ordinary playthrough. This is a random, randomized Nuzlocke. This is like the ultimate test for me. Um, so, let me get out the music here so we can set everything up. So, uh, fast text, battle scenes are going to be on for the time being. Set Battle set is going to be off. Or it's going to be, gonna be it's gonna be set to set instead of shift. I haven't played set in a while, so it's going to really um, put me in a rough spot. So, kind of explain the rules here. Uh, random starters. So, um, there is no torch tick. Uh, well, they could be, but uh, the three starters normally in this game are, are uh, Trico, Torch Tick, and Mudkip. I might not get those. I might get an Eevee, a Charmander, and a Mewtwo. Actually, no, actually, that's not true. I think I banned Legendaries in that part. But, but you get the idea. And the spawn areas are going to be different uh, for Pokemon. So, um, in the first area, I might, nor in the normal game, you'd run into like a Zigzagoon or a Poochiana. This one, this is not the case. I could run into any of the first gen, uh, three generation Pokemon. Any of them. Uh, trainers. You know, gym leaders are going to usually have set types. They don't. They're going to be completely random. Different move sets. Same levels, but different move sets. So, the first um, rules are random Pokemon, random encounters. Um, for each route, I have to catch a Pokemon. Uh, the first, uh, it's going to be the first Pokemon I encounter. So whatever that first encounter is, I got to catch it. Uh, the tr tr the Nuzlocke will not start until after I get some Pokeballs. That way I'm not game overing in the first five minutes of the game. So, uh, without further ado, let's go. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch. And as you can tell, it's random. That was supposed to be, I think, a six again. But it's a Taylo, so that's, that's still third generation. Are we a boy or a girl? And we'll just name us. KYGG, and uh, we're going to nickname every Pokemon we catch, so. All right, here we go. Ooh, okay, sleepy. Oh, okay. Drink of my water here. All right, so we're in the back of a moving van. In order to get out, we've got to go to the right here. And there is Mom. I still have yet to figure out why she chucked us into the back of the truck. And you get your own room. Let's go inside. Okay, so that's the first thing I noticed different in Ruby and Sapphire and Emerald. Uh, in Ruby and Sapphire, it is Machoke's moving stuff, and this game is bigger off. So let's go set our clock real quick. I'm just going to set it for 1 o'clock Pacific or PM. Go. Sort of maybe dad will be on. Oh, it, it's over. I think dad was on, but we missed him. 
Oh yes, Dad... One of Dad's friends lives in this town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door. Alright, so we're gonna go in here and try to find Professor Birch. Daughter is upstairs. Talk to look at this Pokeball here. It's maze Pokeball, better leave it right there. So that will be what it looks like when we find a field item. So, now we're going to go up here. There's a scary Pokemon outside. I can hear the cries. I want to see what's going on, but I don't have any Pokemon. And there is Professor Birch getting attacked by a Zigzagoon. This is where we're going to determine what our starter Pokemon is. Come over here. Oh my goodness. Uh... <laughs> well, what a pleasant surprise. Of course, we're going to pick Blissey. I hope she knows good moves. Okay, at least she knows Pound. That's all that matters. Look at that. <laughs> back here. Alright, so we got our first Pokemon, which is Blissey. We're going to nickname it. Gotta go find May. So May will have one of those starters. So she'll either have a jump pluff or a crocodile. Which I hope she has the crocodile. That'll make it a lot easier. So now we gotta go up through here. Ugh, okay, first encounter. Swallow! Okay. We're gonna go ahead and take him out. Uh oh, that's not good at all. Yeah, okay. Wow. There's no sludge early. We might lose early because of that poison. Good level, though. Actually, we no, we won't. So that means every tick we lose HP. I'm gonna see if we can talk to Mom and get a quick heal. Yeah. So this will negate all the the poison, and it'll fully heal us. So we're good there. So we at least know there's a Swalot in this area. We're trying to... That one does not count because we don't have Pokeballs yet. So now we're going to come up here. See what we got up here. Okay. Oh! Oh my. Okay. Aerodactyl. Can't escape? Uh oh. Oh shit. We got crit. He's faster than us, so we might be in trouble here. Yeah, we're in trouble. We gotta get out of here. So 
Come on, Blissey. Okay, we got out of there. We need to fall back. I was not... Well, that's the best part about randomizers. I was not expecting an Aerodactyl there. And the fact that he's not... He's part rock type, that kind of hurts us. When we get Pokeballs, I hope we come back here and we run into him again. Because I do want to catch one. If we catch one and since it knows Wing Attack, oh man. You want to talk about a wrecking ball for a team. Starting out early. There'll be only be a handful of things they'll be able to stop. Okay. Okay, good. Good, good, good. There's May. Okay, good. Even better. So now... All right, now we're gonna fight May. Yep, I figured as much she had the crocodile. Okay. Weaken him up just a little bit. Oh, okay. He's gonna play that game too. Okay, not a big deal. For stage two here. Hopefully, our pound will. Eh, just as much, but. Oh! Ah, oh, okay, we got him. We gained six HP off that old cow. Oh, there's two. Refresh, okay. So refresh, I think, gets rid of status helmets. Okay. Let's actually look at that real quick. Yeah, so it heals poison paralysis or burn, okay. Pokedex. Okay, the uh, Nuzlocke has officially started. How many Pokeballs do we get? I think we get five. Yeah, we did. Okay. Alright, guys. Here we go. yourself to birch. Yep. Running shoes. So now I can just hold B all the time. Alright, so before we get started into the Nuzlocke here, just trying to go over Blissey here, because I haven't had a chance to. Blissey is a normal type. It is the evolved form of Chansey. As you can see, attack, not very good. Defense, physical defense, not very good. Special attack and special defense are pretty good. And she's not very fast. That being said, she's got a lot of HP. So, a lot of HP means she can take a lot of hits from you. She's holding a repeat ball. That's a free Pokemon. Let right, me get that off of her. Alright, so... 
go ahead and start walking up here. I want to get close to... Okay, here we go. First encounter of the Nuzlocke is a Glalie! Oh, okay. Glalie is a dark ice type. Let's beat him up a little bit and see what we can get. Powdered snow. Okay. Okay. Powdered snow is a ice type move. Be handy against grass, bug, rock. I think rock. It doesn't do a lot to us because we have high special defense, so bear that in mind. Oh, nope, we gotta probably punch it one more time. It can freeze, so that might be a problem. Yeah, see, that was a critical hit. Don't crit? Okay. Double team. So, it, no, so we could definitely do a double team cheese with him. Push came to shove, so that's a good thing. Okay, cool. All right, uh, I forgot to nickname him. Damn it! Oh, uh, we'll just we'll nickname him when we get around to it. It's not a big deal. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and heal up. And we'll take a look at Glalie. I think that's how you pronounce it, Glalie. Gla... Gli... Gla... Glalie. I don't know. Oh! It knows a... Actually, really good moves. Leer with a bite. Double team and powdered snow. We're gonna set him up front in case we run into another, uh... Uh... Aerodactyl. Pokeballs. It gives us a premier ball, so that's free. Three potions. Yeah, why not? And four antidotes. I don't think we'll need the antidotes, but if we run into another swallow with poison gas, we might need one on the long haul. Now we gotta catch one up here. Come on, please be Aerodactyl. Please be Aerodactyl. Please be Aerodactyl. Aerodactyl? Aerodactyl? Oh no! It's a gulpin! That's not good. Oh no! I wanted an Aerodactyl. <laughs> Try to catch it now. I doubt we're gonna catch it this time. There we got it. Okay. I think we have our first sacrificial Pokemon. Too, so see what our first Pokemon's gonna be here. Hopefully something good. Ivysaur! Okay! I can work with him. Let's beat him up a little bit so we can catch him. We try to. Oh, I gotta be careful with that. Yeah, go ahead and growl, buddy. I don't care. Try to catch it. Nope. 
Okay. One wiggle. Okay, no tackle. Not very powerful. Come on. I might have to swap out the Chansey. Or not Chansey, but uh, the Thick. Let her take some of these hits. Yes, that's exactly what I want you to do, because I need to hit you at least one time with pound. Yeah. Oh no, three damage. Oh, okay. That should be good. That scared me for a second. I was afraid that was going to crit. Oh, come on, you were right there. I could affect him, like put him to sleep or something like that. Come on, Ivysaur, be a good boy. Oh no, that's bad. Bad luck, guys! I really want this Ivy Sword. Might have to switch out to Galley. I could do that, actually. I could switch back to Galley and use the Powdered Snow. Shit, it. I thought I healed them. Kill it off, I might have to kill it and run. And then I'm then this route's forfeit. You just need seated in my galley too. Oh well, yeah, four more Pokeballs, so. Uh-oh. Yep. Probably gonna I'm gonna switch into gulping. Get a couple more attempts. but I'm hesitant. Nope. I got that repeat ball and that's it. I don't think I'll be able to get it with a repeat ball. I guarantee it's gonna break out instantly. Hold it. 
Yep, I'm gonna have to run. That sucks. Alright, let's get out of here. Well, as you can see, they don't go as planned. I gotta put, um, Gulpin. Sucks. Um, I was hoping we'd get an Ivy Sword, but apparently that's not going to happen. And I can't catch any more Pokemon on that route. So, yeah. If I white out, it's it's a uh, it's GG. So, who's in front? See who we first fight are. We only got one Pokemon. Scyther! Oh, okay. I can I can I can work with this, because Scyther is bug flying. Powdered snow will be super effective. Oh, that was super effective by oh. Wow. For the layer that was lucky. I was hoping he would. Oh, it still didn't kill it. Oh no. Um, no. Um, let's switch out. It's only one Pokemon. I'm not gonna sacrifice him. So cool. All right, let's get it. Hi, Tugs. You're wondering if one of my cats tugs me out. Eleven. A crit. See, that would have that would have screwed. Uh, he went to level four. Nice. Level five. Nice. Good. 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 So, in typical fashion, I'm gonna fall back and. Bother me, but not bother, bother me. All right, I think we'll end the part here with this bug catcher battle. All right. Like I said, it might be a bug catcher, but the pe the Pokemon are random, so we don't know what we'll get. Gorbis? Okay. Okay. Uh, I think they're psychic types. So we'll try a bite. No, they're not. Okay. Wolf pool. Okay. Whirlpool is, uh, not a bad move, uh, but they do have a D.O.T. A D.O.T. is not very powerful. Say so three bites and he'll be dead. Remember, it's on set, so it's gonna set out whatever's next. Nice, Glalie's level six. Glygar! Glygar is ground flying. So, powder snow, and we're faster than two, it's good. Powder snow, hopefully, is quad. Quad. <laughs> quad weakness. Well, we putting in some work early game. I like this, guys. So, 
I'm going to save it here, and we're going to end the part. Go ahead and like, subscribe, share with your friends. You want to see more Pokemon Emerald Nuz randomized Nuzlocke, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Later!